so okay i've been watching um oh, what's it called i've been watching inside job lately on netflix uh just while chilling out and doing something else and first off it's a good show but this song it makes me think of the opening for that show which i really like the opening for it <laughs> I could tell. I haven't watched Gravity Falls, but it totally looks like it's a it's the exact same like style with the way they draw people and stuff. I really like the main character too in um Inside Job. I can like all the characters in Inside Job. I'm really liking the show. Some of the jokes they make too are fucking fire. As the kids say. Like at one point, B. What are you making B's for? What does that mean? Baked beans? Why you why why does post baked beans? Anyway. Uh, sorry, my wife's being weird. Uh so like so I'm still setting up here and I'm just kinda of talking while I'm doing that. Um What was I saying about inside job? Okay, so there was this one joke in there. Oh my gosh. It was like rep oh, hey Leviathan. Welcome, welcome. Um, but yeah, oh yeah, Gleviathan Dune was great, by the way. I actually really enjoyed it. Uh, the first half of it's pretty slow, but there's a lot like of world building that they have to set up and shit. Um, and I guess we, we looked it up because there's like, what, six books in total? There's like six, there's six main Dune books. This movie is the first half of the first book. Because it's technically called Dune Part 1. Anyway, so back to Inside Job. There was this one joke. Oh my gosh. Like, the reptilians were having a conference, and they were they were talking about how well they were doing with, like, the media and controlling the media. And one of the things they mentioned that they did was they got King K. Rule in Smash. And Torrance and I found that very funny. Holy hell what? What's what's hellish? What's going on? What's crack a lacking? Oh, and by the way, hi everybody. I guess we might as well get this stream started. Oh yes, okay, on I still got some setup to do. Rika Rika wants her little special stream on the side. Although I still say that she should be on voice with us if she's going to have this special stream, but yeah, that's just me. We need people to scream because I don't scream in fear. I might give a yelp now and then. Um, but I, I don't usually scream. I scream in anger. Try not to. Uh, it's taking forever to open up. Yes, it's it's only it's only the first part of the first book. So, and however, they've got it, it was pretty it was pretty impressive. I enjoyed the movie quite a bit, and I know it's been getting like rave reviews from audiences and reviewers alike. So, I definitely can see them making the other movies. And I know I think the second part's already in production. That, I think that's a guaranteed that it's going to come out, but I can see them going through all the books afterwards and just making this like, you know, every like two year, every one to two years, we'll get another Dune movie. <laughs> He's bang your knee. That's not good, Cody Cat. You should probably put a pillow on your knee then. One of your cats. All right, that's uh, oh great, it's messed up audio. Just a moment, I know music's cut out. That's okay. Give me just a moment. I'll get that set back up. Here. Okay. There we go. Sound should be back on.
I saw parts of the original Dune movie, um, and I haven't read the books at all, but, you know, because it's Dune, there's shit tons of things reference it, and it's, you know, it's it, it's just parodied and referenced all the time, and memes about it and stuff. So you kind of, it's like, it's like how I've never seen Jaws. I've never watched Jaws, but I've seen enough clips that I could probably piece the whole movie together. And I can also quote lots of things from the movie that I've never seen, so. Anyway, I've got some micheladas here to drink. <laughs> be cracking that open and we'll be getting into this game. Let me turn off this sweet fucking jam we got going on here. We can get into the actual game itself. All right. Yeah, exactly. Who you know controls the spice, controls the universe, all that kind of stuff. Something that is really weird. Ooh, hold on. Select a game mode. Assisted. Standard. Hardcore. Okay, so a standard is normal. Hardcore is saving requires an ink ribbon, no auto save, stronger enemies. We're gonna go with we're gonna go with fucking standard for this, boys. I I don't like dealing with all that saving shit. We ain't doing that. Nah. -uh. <laughs> so yeah, not a spoiler, but something really weird is that the it's like the story takes place Look, like in the oh hold on. Hey, let's get into this I game. You, buddy. I believe you. <laughs> Just tell us a story. Tell us a story. Okay. Well, it was last Friday night. I was walking home from the bar. Oh man, I'm just sucks good. Me. She was staggering, you know. So I, I figured she was drunk. I'm talking whoa, about the burger, not his facial whoa, whoa. hair. Whoa. Okay. Tell us, be honest, Just to be clear. How many drinks did you have? No, man. I, I barely had a buzz on. Oh come on. Look, just listen, all right? She got closer, and I got a good look at her. You had to see her eyes, her nose, her whole face. It looked like it was rotting. Yeah. She looked like a corpse. Like a walking corpse, man. <laughs> Sounds like my wife. Oh! Calm down, buddy. Calm down. Hey, you got to stay strong, okay? Don't give in to fear out there, right? Yeah, well, you got that right. If you freeze up around these things, they'll sink to pieces. Oh, come on. Just getting good. You know that being a truck the being a trucker is the number one job in America. There are more truckers than any other profession. Oh, damn, she flew off that truck. There's no way that truck stopped hard enough for her to go flying off of it like that. You don't consume mass popular media. I, on the other hand, consume lots of mass. Anyway, back to the game. <laughs> Ah, uh, dude, no, she's gonna attack you. She's a zombie. Oh. Ah, oh, poor guy. Yeah, Dune is OG. Dune is like the Lord of the Rings. For sci-fi, like space sci-fis and stuff. <clears throat> We're talking like, you know, Captain Kirk Star Trek levels <clears throat> in book form. No one's around. That's weird. Oh man, he looks weird. Is it just me or does Leon look fucking weird, man? I guess he's really young here though.
This is because I think he's pretty new to um No, I, I don't think Leon worked for Umbrella. He works uh he's like new to the police force. Here in Raccoon City. And even then I think he's like at a pos I think he's at like some other kind of station outside of the city. And now he's like heading into it or something. Something like that. I remember exactly. Did you just say your parents are donkeys? I'm sorry, I'm not really paying attention to chat right now. I'm trying to play a scary game. <laughs> Hello? Yeah, but disc Anybody donkeys. There? Oh, jockeys. Hmm. So they ride horses. And they're very small. Something's not right. Oh yeah, shit's going weird. You all right? Don't move. I'll be back for you. The you know, game looks good. Yeah, I'm playing on the PS5, but this is uh, PS4. They haven't made a PS5 upscale for it yet. Officer, you need help? Stay back, sir. I got this. Hey! Damn, he tore out his fucking like, esophagus. What the? Really? I gotta do three headshots on this guy? Ugh. I'm glad I'm not playing on hardcore mode. What the fuck, man? Oh shit, a wall safe. Let's grab, let's grab some, uh... Oh, it's a, never mind, it's a key. Key rack, I guess. Storage room. Okay, cool, cool. E to the gas station's storage room. Now, I did play Resident Evil 2 uh, way back on the Nintendo 64, um, but I didn't own the game. It was my cousin's. I, mean, I only played like the very beginning of it, and I can already tell you it didn't start like this. No this can't be. It Okay, so three headshots aren't enough for this fucker? Four headshots. I think five. Okay, so wait, what was that? Was that six headshots altogether? What the actual fuck? So much for hit him in the brain, huh? Uh, so anyway, using key items. Yeah, just use Cool. I'm getting the fuck out of here. Uh, okay, I guess I can't get the fuck out of there. Ooh, things great. Don't shoot! Get down! Wait, I don't have any bullets. Leon, where'd that magic one bullet come from? Also, fuck that. That guy would not die with one hit. You all right? Yeah, I think so. Thanks. Thank me later, when we're safe. Holy shit. John Carpenter's The Thing. Come on! Get in! Hold on. There sure are a lot of zombies out of fucking nowhere. I don't know. 
Hopefully they'll have some answers at the police station. Wait, you're a cop? Yeah, Leon Kennedy. You are? Clear. Clear Redfield. Live around here? Ah, uh, Chris Redfield. No. I'm looking for my brother. He's a cop too. Hmm? Well, it's a good thing we found each other. I don't know what to expect anymore. Okay, so I'm thinking also maybe not only is Leon like much younger in this game than in Resident Evil 4 and future other games, but uh, there's also a pretty big long standing. Uh, that was cool. There's a big long standing theory that a lot of that the main characters in the Resident Evil games are all uh, people who are infected, but they have been they're properly infected. Um, and that also might be why he kind of looks different later on. Because the, the infection isn't supposed to, it's, it's not supposed to be zombifying people. Like, that's not the purpose of it. It's supposed to basically make super soldiers, like super people. So, like, Jill, Chris, Leon, um, it's basically... It's, it's all but confirmed, because I don't think it is officially confirmed that they are all infected people. Attention all citizens. Due to the citywide outbreak, you are advised to take shelter at the Raccoon City Police Station. Free food and medical supplies will be provided to everyone in need. Oh my god, this is so unreal. Police station's not much farther. They'll know something. Yeah, but what if we're the only ones? What if there's no survivors? No, there's survivors. It's a big city. There has to be. <coughs> yeah, and Biohazard. We know that one. And then, Looks like we're walking um, here. Going into like village and everything too. More like running. Yeah, Actually, in in <laughs> Resident Evil Village. Leon, you gotta back up. Ooh we. Uh oh. Oh fuck. What the Oh, look, it's him! It's a callback! Get out now! I can't! Hold on! Oh, no, Derek. By the way, I'm calling him Derek now. That's that's the truck driver. Oh, fuck. Well, it's a good thing we didn't choose to play Claire's story. <laughs> nah, just kidding. She's fine, probably. Because <laughs> you got to, because in the beginning you have to choose Leon or Claire. Claire! And I, Claire, are you okay? You choose Claire's story, you get to this part in credits roll. <laughs> yeah. I still don't have any ammo. <laughs> Leon, put your damn gun away unless you're gonna be pistol whipping him. Shit. It's everybody. They all turned. Ooh, I don't know if I'd be running down alleys. There it is. <laughs> Seems like a good way to get trapped. 
Oh, I see they set the station up in ye old haunted castle. Oh man, this is one hell of a zombie apocalypse, huh? Wait, there's... You gave me an invisible wall? You really gave me an invisible wall right there, game. Fuck you. Baby, pull your mic over. Why aren't there any children zombies? Um, that's because in video games, they don't want you killing children. No, it's true. I, I get that, but, like, it doesn't make sense at all in the world. You sound really far away for some reason. Sound very far away? Yeah. Is it just me? Does she sound really far away, guys? Let me see. Hold on. Uh, but yeah, that's, uh, Glove, I think that's actually one of the reasons, too, why people talk about it is because uh, it's not just like, oh, if you play bad, you get, you know, bitten and stuff. But like literally there are cutscenes in which um, like Leon and Chris and Jill and stuff were in which they get, you know, bitten and stuff in cutscenes. OK, uh, talk now. Talk. Hello. Very good. OK, excellent. That should be fine. That should be fine. Yes. Maybe now it's a little too loud. Uh, doing audio adjustments. Give me a test. Hello. Hello. Okay. I think that's okay. Let me, guys, let me, let me know if she's too loud or obnoxious or something. All right. I'm going to walk around with my Is gun anybody out. anybody here? Hmm, I don't know about this. Things look pretty wet and splattered in here. Looks like a bad idea. Okay. Oh, I'm sure we're gonna be fine, boys. What difficulty you put this on? Normal. All right, need to get a fuse. <laughs> Boris when he blocks two blocks away. When Boris is in the same room as you, he sounds like he's barking like two blocks away. These damn zombies have flooded the police station. What are they planning? You got this. Fall through the window. Nope. I like his little pep talk he gave himself there. It was kind of fun. Come on, Leon, get your shit together. It's just zombies. They're slow and you're fast. Fast like a, like a cheetah, yeah. Leon the cheetah, that's what they'll call me. I like the bite mark that's still on my jacket. <laughs> looks like looks like a real sloppy kiss with lipstick <laughs> or barbecue sauce on the lips did it. All right, what am I looking for in here now? Lights on. I'm supposed to find like a fuse or something, I think. Found the hydrant. Leon, no, that's the women's restroom. What are you doing, boy? Oh, I see where the water's coming from. <laughs> well, that's lovely. Aw, oh, sweet. Healing spray, boys. Yay, first aid spray. 
Hells yeah. Yes, Leviathan, it is. It's the one with Mr. Mr. X. X. Oh. Mr. X. Yes. X gonna give it to me, boys, and I'm not ready for it. <laughs> I, I, I'm not even kidding you. Okay. Okay, well, I need to turn you down just a little bit. You're at least loud in my ears. <laughs> you couldn't mute. No, I'm not gonna mute you. I just need to turn you down a little bit is all. Okay. Give me a test real quick. No. <sighs> um. Anyway, so yeah, I've played, you know, I've played Resident Evil 4, 5, 6, um, 7. I did Village on stream. Not worried about playing them at all. In fact, I do the spooky stream regularly, usually once a week. And you know what? I don't have any trepidation. This game, honestly, I'm a little anxious going into this. He doesn't like being chased. Uh, it's just, I already know from fucking Uncle Abraham Jesus. in Made of Skur that the big fucking guy Open stomp. Hurry. What the fuck? Open up! Open this goddamn door! I'll get you out! Oh, no, this isn't a bad idea. Please. Give me your hand. Help me. I got you. Give me your other hand. Uh oh, uh oh. Uh, no, 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 Oh, no. Oh, fucking hell. RPD, more like R.I.P.D. Am I right, boys? Hell. Oh, oh, <laughs> Officer's oh, notebook. <laughs> oh, boys, I gotta say, I, I think that, I think maybe this officer was. Mentally handicapped? <laughs> What's up with this drawing? I, I like the question mark. What the fuck is the question mark? <laughs> this is literally a step one, step two, question marks, profit. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> okay, so... These? Wait, baby, what? What? The drawings, the three drawings of the statue. Yeah, okay, so apparently the way out is through the parking garage, the unknown. There's a big-ass fucking ladder in there, an elevator, some kind of door system that's underground. But to get to that, we need to put three medallions in the goddess statue. And this is showing uh, that there's three different statues, and these are the different medallions we need. So the goddess statue over there, it looks like Aquarius, by the way, because she's holding that... Uh, jug, so she's the water bearer, it looks like. Um, but we got to put the uh, maybe that's Virgo, Sagittarius, and there's no fucking snake one. Anyway, we got to put woman, archery, snake, and hers. Uh, there's also, it looks like, a unicorn and a hipster lion, as far as I can tell. Yeah. Okay, cool. Um, did he happen to have ammo on him? Why is there no ammo in this police department? What the fuck is this now? Okay, is there a fucking melee move? Do I got quick time events? Oh my god, can I not use the door? What's the symbol mean? What does the symbol mean? Why has the door got a fucking symbol? What do you want me to do with the fucking door? That's it? I just put my hand on it? Cool. Oh my god. I just don't even know what I'm supposed to be doing now in this game.
What's this? Fucking finally. Um, making use of the map. Cool, cool, cool. Um, let's also use the first aid spray. Uh, I just... How many shots is it going to take to kill you guys? Because I don't have enough to put... To put, uh, five bullets in each of your guys' heads. God damn it. Fucking way too many headshots are needed for these guys. For beginning of the game zombies. Okay, can't go in there. Don't have the fuse, so can't do anything there. <laughs> Don't let me die like that other guy! Oh shit, dude. That Marvin is a Brana. big fucking gash. Leon Kennedy. But there was another officer I could I could Yeah. I'm sure you did what you could, Leon. Look that face he made looked like he was already going zombie on me. Honestly, all you need to know is that this place will eat you alive if you aren't careful. Yeah, well, I was supposed there to start we last week, and I got a call to stay away. I wish I'd come here sooner. You're here now, Leon. That's all that matters. Okay, Lieutenant. I'm ready. Hopefully, you'll be able to find a way out of this station. That officer you met earlier, Elliot. He thought this secret passageway might do the trick. <laughs> Oh, thanks. You got blood all over it. We can get you to hospital. That's no, helpful. No, I am not the priority here. <laughs> Lieutenant, I'm not just going to leave you here. I'm giving you an order, rookie. You save yourself first. Damn. I'd come with you, but I just slow you down. Now. This guy's badass. You need this. I can't take it. Stop. And don't make my mistake. If you see one of those things, uniform or not, you do not hesitate. You take it out, or you run. Got it? Yes, sir. <laughs> now I can finally do melee attacks. <sighs> Turning into a zombie. Combat nice knife. I don't know why I said nice. Equip it on the inventory screen to use. This knife wears down and will with use and will break when its gauge is depleted. Awesome. Ready and slash. Can be used to counterattack L1 when you are caught by an enemy and can only be retrieved once you defeat them. Okay, wait a minute. I can get rid of this fucking key, right? Yeah, I'm gonna can I discard this thing okay I'll keep it for now like I guess I'll keep it until I'm running out of space but I don't think I'm going back to that gas station I move it and I like set one of those no won't let me okay and move this over to here Okay, so that's L2, and this is L1. Not fight! Ah, oh, shit, look at that. He's got that fucking, like, ninja style back there. Oh, here's the goddess statue, right? Awesome. I don't know why... I don't know why we're... I don't know why the taxpayers are paying for 
secret passages that are activated by medallions uh, <laughs> in the police station. But hey, you know, there you go. It's a Resident Evil game, so. Also, you know, everybody's, everyone's police station, they got those, those doors that, they got the doors with the symbol on them and you got to find the key with that symbol. <laughs> you know, standard, this is not standard uh, public building <laughs> procedures. You're building your uh, police stations. You got to put the spade door in. There's probably like, I don't know, like a dragon door or a lion door or maybe a goat door or something. Hey, more ammo. Okay, so 12 is the maximum ammo capacity. Oh, Aw, shit. Shit, Cody Cat. We got green herbs. Whack a cock. Oh, I'm wait. I'm ready for, like, zombies, dogs to come flying through windows at me. Once more into the darkness. Oh God. Start by stabbing him in the head is what I would do. Hey, it's the Jen. Hi, Jen. Oh yeah, zombie dogs suck. Wait, what am I? What does it want me to do here? That was weird. How was he even hanging up there? Why was he even? I don't... Okay. <laughs> oh, apparently they put in um, fucking card-based uh, doors <laughs> in their police department. Oh, is that the guy out there? Marvin Brana or is... I don't remember. I'm bad with names. I think that's him. I think he was cop of the month. That's cool. Why does it keep... Okay, I don't know why it keeps wanting me to use items on these windows. Rather ominous. Can I just stab you through the thing? No? Okay. me to do here. <laughs> okay, I can go that way, but first I'm going to go check out this side. Alright, never mind. I'm going this way. I don't know. I don't, why does this one feel scarier than Resident Evil Village? Both Village and uh, Biohazard were not Nearly. This one's already way scarier than those ones. Record of events. September 25th. We're turning the station into a temporary shelter due to the massive sudden outbreak. All police personnel have been instructed to make the safety of the citizens their top priority as we try to accommodate as many of them as possible. On September 20... Oh, sorry. September 25th, addendum. One of the refugees attacked us in the middle of the night, resulting in the death of one officer and injuring three others. 
The person in question was quickly restrained. We believe this was simply a case of someone snapping under intense stress. September 26th, a mob attacked the station today, resulting in a number of casualties. A few survivors were able to make it safely behind the emergency shutters, but surrounded as we are, it'll be hard for any of us to escape this place. We're not sure if we can fix any of our comm equipment, so we remain cut off from the outside world. September 27th. There was another clash on the west side of the station around 1 p.m. Twelve people died, and there is only a handful of survivors left. Everything is falling into disarray here. David Ford. Oh, nice. Okay, so... That's the main hall. This is the fucking area I was at. <laughs> getting attacked by everything. That's where the goddess statue is. We are now over here in the operations room. Mm hmm. And it looks like we got a lot of exploring to do here. Luce, we've got a lot of exploring to do. Oh, damn. Where does this go? Okay, that goes out into the hallway. Don't want to do that yet. Uh, if I'm going to have to, they don't got bolt cutters. Which I'm assuming is what we need for that. Nice. Okay, so go down this route. Why did I decide to play uh, shooter on <laughs> the PS5? Oh my god. Oh, well, that was a good use of my bullets, boys. What was that question, hon? Why did I decide to play a shooter on the PlayStation 5? I don't know. I kept telling you to get on the team. I know, but I want to play games on my PS5 right now. Yeah, but you don't like doing shooters. <laughs> but look at this. The controller, the colors on the controller tell you how much health you have. See, right now it's green, because I have good health. Yeah, but you don't like doing shooters with a console. Oh my god, is it going to make me <laughs> find these buttons? I can push these buttons. Right. Storage locker terminal memo. It appears that the keypad to the locker's terminal is missing a few keys. I suggest that the person responsible for this mess find some spare keys and fix this right now. You know who you are, bastard. Who else would fuck it up this badly? Miko. Uh, Miko's playing a little too rough with Kyra right now. Oh man, look, there's goodies in here. Oh, shotgun shells. Oh, a shotgun, even better. Ah, we need a key for the key card. PS5. PS5. What's wrong with PS5s? I think they want one, but they can't get one. Oh, is it still that bad? <laughs> I didn't know that they were still still so hard to get. I guess I haven't been looking after looking at them, you know, since we got one. Is it really still that bad? It's ridiculous. Ridiculous. Uh oh. Uh oh. Gotcha. Two oh three. Two oh eight. Let's try seeing if we can do this. We should still be able to push these buttons. No? I mean, what? These keys aren't magic. You just push the thing that's underneath the key. Okay. Okay. That's fine. We'll go fucking find ourselves some goddamn keys, I guess. Okay, wait. 102, 103. Why does everything need 
106. Okay, I can open up that one. Let's go do that. Also, what's the point of this locker system? If anybody can just punch in these codes, it's not exactly um, secure, is it? Roll of film. Awesome. This is what we need right now. Mm. Oh, look how the zombies look in this game. It's so gross. Gruesome. Is this guy still alive? Oh my god. Uh, I'll plug it. Yeah, I'll plug my... For real, though. Like, why don't these guys just fucking stay down? Like, I know they're zombies. But Jesus Christ, there's like no way to... They, are all enemies immortal in this game? Yeah, 109. Alright, let me plug in my controller real quick. There we go. Okay, so over here, this was... This had a three and a two. Can't do those. Because two and three are the ones we're missing. Same thing with this side. All this side is two. Cool. No keys over here. No key card. What? Why is it still alive? What the actual fuck? You okay. There we go. It's that head... Its head is goddamn exploded. If it gets back up, I'm goddamn done. What is wrong with this game? This guy, I shot him once in the head, and he seems content. Okay, dark rooms over that way. Let's go back over here. See if we can go into this door. Nope. At least it's not fixed camera angles, huh? Yeah, that's true. Okay, I think that's... I think those are bars on that window, so I think we're okay. Oh, okay, wooden boards. Nice. That's why it was giving me the option to look at these. Oh, nice. Yeah, no, that's cool. Um, green herb native to the Arclay Mountains. It will restore a small amount of health. But can we combine it with another bird? Make a nice. mixed herb. Oh shit, boys, we're mixing herbs. Thought that coat rack was a person. Gunpowder. Cool, cool. I guess we're going to be making our own fucking bullets. <laughs> <laughs> Medicinal benefits of herbs. The humans have always used herbs to treat sickness and disease since the dawn of time. In this book, we will explore three such herbs native to the Arclay Mountains. Green herbs have the ability to heal basic injuries, while blue herbs have long been used to treat poisoning. As for red herbs, while they are visually appealing, they offer no medical benefits, or so it was thought until recently. 
It's well known that combining herbs together produces blends that heighten the herbs' effects, but it has been discovered that red herbs can play a big role when mixed properly. According to one doctor of Asian medicine, mixing blue and red herbs together produces a blend that will strengthen one's constitution. Truly, we have only just begun to realize the full potential of these herbs and their ability to heal the human body. Further research is sure to yield even more fascinating results. So what I'm so what I'm hearing is what I'm hearing is uh, red herbs won't do dick by themselves. Blue herbs will heal poison, so that means there's poison in this game. That's fun. But we want to save our red and blue herbs so we can mix them together because I think that'll increase our maximum HP. Question mark. Oh fuck yeah, boys. Time for us to do our first save of the game. Probably shouldn't have waited this long. <laughs> Boner pills. Yeah, I fucking hate any game with fixed camera angles. It sucks so bad. Oh, nice storage. I'm glad now we didn't drop the keys. Now uh, we'll go ahead and throw gunpowder in here as well for now. Our knife is almost done. Your knife is almost what? It's almost done. It's almost destroyed. Oh. Film contains evidence. Do not leave out. Red herb! Fucking sweet boys, we just talked about it. I wish it would just auto put things into my inventory when I pick them up. Okay. Let's do a roll of film. Commemorative photo. All right. This was in evidence storage. Not sure why. Not sure what we needed that for at all. Okay. I mean, he's got a book there with like a heart on it. Maybe that's the heart key. Is that a key? Is it just a scepter? Is that here in the building? I don't... I mean, I guess I'm happy we got that. <laughs> Seems important, huh? A lion statue? I don't know. I don't know. Fucking know. All right, well, let's actually drop that uh, red herb in now. All right, we can go up the stairs. I think we need to, because I think... Oh, I didn't try the fucking west office door? Are you kidding me? All right, that's cool. That's fine. We can go try that right now. Dude, calm down. He is just... He's going ham over there. Ah, great. More people pretending to be dead. Gunpowder. Uses a gunpowder. Handgun ammo, gunpowder times two. Shotgun shells, gunpowder plus high grade gunpowder, yellow. Mag ammo, high grade gunpowder, yellow times two. There's a lot of ammo left around the station, so make good use of any gunpowder you find. Different guns require different ammo, so pay attention when you're combining things or you won't get what you need. I get excited every time I see the box of bullets because it's red. And for some reason in my head, that's that means it's going to be magnum ammo instead of regular handgun ammo. <laughs> handgun ammo. Operation report. September 28, 2.30 a.m. It's down to just me and three others. No weapons, no ammo. And too many skirmishes have drained us mentally and physically. We're not going to make it. Officer Phillips once suggested we escape through the sewers. Apparently, there's a secret tunnel under this place left over from its museum days. I guess the sewers then are the question mark that was on that map. Oh, no. Is Officer Phillips the guy that got bifurcated? <laughs> I brushed her idea. Oh, yeah, I guess not, because... Okay, I brushed her idea. You know, I don't know. Maybe 
Maybe that guy was a non-presenting trans. It's fine. I don't know. I don't know. I brushed her idea off before, but now it's not sounding all that bad. Yeah, there's no proof there's even a tunnel or that the sewers aren't infested with zombies. But I don't want to sit here and wait to die either. It's a long shot, but I'm going to try to find out what I can about that tunnel. Oh, maybe actually that was Elliot then. Or I don't know, maybe his name was Charles. No, Charles was the truck driver, according to Leviathan. <sighs> Who's making noises over here? You stop it. I'm armed. I'm warning you. The way he came out with his neck all sideways, it's like, what the hell, man? God damn it. They're so bobbly. Rookie's first assignment. Leon S. Kennedy, we're putting you on a very special case for your first assignment. Your mission is to unlock your desk. The key to your success is in the initials of our first names. Put the letters in order of our desks. There are two locks, one on each side of your desk. Make sure you get them both. Basically, your first task is to remember your own fellow officers' names. But you figured that much out, right? Good luck, Leon. By the way, it might take a little work to get Scott to give you a straight answer. Scrawled in a corner between drops of blood. Be glad you're not here, rookie. God, hold on, everybody. Got to save a skeleton. All right, Frankie's maybe lost the <laughs> lost the tip of his pinky toe. <laughs> Pico, don't you go chewing on Frankie no more. Okay. I heard a noise behind me. I looked back there. I'm like, okay, what is Miko chewing on? Hold on. Had to pop open another Michelada. Okay, so initials. Okay, the key to the success. Initials of the first names. There's two locks, one on each side of the desk. So we need the initials of them. Nice. <laughs> Welcome, Leon. <laughs> oh, that's rather cute. Look at this. Oh, look, they were all ready for him. Oh, I like this. Am I crazy or am I hearing like a wind up toy? Uh, I think I shoot it. What is wrong with this game? This isn't even hard, it's just annoying. Can I just stomp his head? Just... Are you kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? Oh, I guess just fuck me because I came over trying to like actually do some... Do something. Why? How many headshots Shit. does it take to kill a basic zombie in this game? Oh my god. Okay, it, I mean, that was the last use of my... I don't know, is he getting back up? Can I go near him now? He's on the door. This is... Who designed this? Why? Oh, no. And now this guy's suddenly... Cool. No, this is what I like. I like using, like, a full fucking clip on one zombie. What the? What the what? What is my character what thing about? <sighs> oh, 
Uh, check the body. They might have okay, a bullet. Okay, hon. We've got... George Scott. What the fuck is George's... What the fuck is George's middle name? No. Okay, it's the first letter. Sorry, it's the first letter. Okay, so N E N E D. I gotcha, I gotcha. N E Curtis Break. M R G. M R G. High capacity Magnum or Matilda. Oh, look, your name on your desk. Oh, I know. I like this. This is nice. Feel this good is vibes. Sad. Feel good this vibes. This is very with this. sad. Nice. So I guess my gun's now called Matilda. Maybe it was called Matilda already, and I just didn't notice before. Again, I'm pretty bad with names. I'm just waiting for that fucking zombie to get back up again. Oh, good, 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 good. Guessing this was like at least our squad lieutenant or captain or whatever. What squad was I joining anyway? Jojo. Senor just came home, and dog is, of course, going to be acting up a little bit now. Well, we've got a safe there, so we'll have to come back for that at some other point. I don't know how to exit. Uh, for now, let's head for those stairs, though. I'm gonna get my barons. I wonder if those boards now permanently lock that window down or if I'm going to have to like replace them. All right, what's this? Uh, she's fine for now. Son of a bitch. Me. I swear this game is this game can go fuck itself. Like okay, okay, like maybe maybe you guys know or something like is it something about this game where shooting them in the head is actually bad? Am I supposed to be shooting them like in the chest or the stomach or something like special for these zombies? Because this is this is pretty ridiculous at this point. Oh my god, are you fucking kidding me? He's about to get back up, watch. Should I shoot them when they're down? I don't even... Alright, well that guy at least popped like a water balloon. Do they all do, do, they all do that? Have I, am I supposed to have been doing that this whole time? Steel boy! Yeah, but do you do that when you're playing a game that's... After you shot the zombie three times in the head, portable safe. Ooh. Uh, 
uh, portable safes for when you want the thief to be able to crack your safe in the luxury of their own home during their free time. <laughs> I mean, right? Let's see. Okay, I see how this is going. Okay, so. Nope. Oops, shit. Wrong one. Wait, was it the wrong one? It was this one here, right? Okay. And what's the next one? Okay, cool. Well, might as well... Uh, there we go. Also, not much of a safe. I mean, right? <laughs> it was like a children's game. Cool. That's one of the keys. Okay, that could help. We could try that. Thank you very much. Press a button to light up its corresponding lamp. Light them all to open the safe. Okay, cool. We just did that. I don't know why that's like even a thing. Yeah, I'm gonna go see if I can pop this guy in the head. His head's not popping, which makes me think maybe he's still alive. I'm gonna shoot him till his head pops. There we go. I'm done with this shit. Although that just seems like such a waste. No, there's not. You'd think that way. I went and tried to do that, and instead I got bit in the leg for my trouble. And then I had to use the last of my knife. Wait, it is? It, I got no stomp action. I got leg bit instead. Unless you're saying it is to something else, but if there is a stomp their head, it's not that I've seen yet. Right, I know. We got some more combo letters. Got the spade key, boys. <laughs> the spade key. Who the fuck works up in this office? Like, I don't, I don't think that's zombie related. I think that's just, that's just sh <laughs> the shitty building. Well, at least we should. What in the okay, I was literally just about to say at least we don't have to worry about zombies breaking in the windows up on the third floor, but apparently we do. So, welcome to Resident Evil 2, I guess. Get fucked. Any survivors, consider this a gift for anyone still unfortunate enough to be alive. Keep your eyes peeled for those creepy fucks that look like they were skinned alive. Lickers, we call them. They're blind as bats, but they're hearing more than makes up for that. So long as you don't run around like a total idiot, guns a blazing, you should be able to slip right by them. Probably. Either way, make like a grandma and creep around as slow as possible around him, yeah? Anyway, not that I want to go, but duty calls. That and I've got a friend to avenge. I like David. He sounds cool. 
Leon has a psychic ability that allows him to hear people's voices, uh, people who wrote the wrote the messages. It's a little known fact, but it's true. View files. What? What? Oh, okay. I was trying to figure out what it was wanting me to do. Okay, so apparently it's obviously a liquor that went by the third floor window. Is that like liquor shit then? I guess so, because there's claw marks. Man, these guys poop a lot. Okay, so I'm going to creep around like a grandma, as was mentioned. Look, baby, there's a doll. Mm -mm. Nope, I don't like that. All right, we're going to return to creep mode. Let's creep. Are you dead? You're going to like fall on me, aren't you? Okay, so that's a door. I don't want to go that way yet. I'm not done creeping. Ah, oh, sweet grandfather clock, dude. Oh, is that fucking C4? <laughs> Uh, I don't have a detonator for this. That's cool. That's cool. We'll have to come back and take a look see at that. Some guy scribblings. Damn, those corporate assholes, they cut me off after all I've done for them. But if that's how it's going to be, so be it. I'm going to have a little fun of my own as the world goes to sit. I boarded all those filthy pigs up in a steel pen and set them C4. All I got to do is detonate it and it's cyanide, suckers. But it's no fun if it's over too soon. So maybe I'll give that one raving loon something to really squeal about. Yeah, maybe I'll give him a little toy and tell him, kill the guy next to you and I'll spare the others. I wonder what he'll do. You yell about justice and pride, but how many times did you go against me, your own superior? Yeah, you're such a good cop. So good you had to die. Man, is this fun. I need some music for this. Hip pouch. Oh, sweet. <laughs> Hip to add squares. That was the uh, achievement I got for that. As you can see it. That's that's a fun achievement name. <gasps> Look, a medallion. Oh, it's the water bearer. Okay, so that's just showing where the... Hmm, okay. Gotcha, gotcha. <clears throat> We're gonna creep around. Be all nice and creepy. The library. It's a rather large and impressive library for a police department. Leon, it's Marvin. I need you back here ASAP. Are you okay, Marvin? I've got something to show you. It's important. Copy that. I'll be right there. All right, so we're going to need to move this, right? I'm assuming maybe, maybe not. I mean, if I can just walk across over here. Time to check the books. Nope. Nothing up here. Now, yeah, we are going to have to move that stuff over. But why would we need to? There's... It's okay, what's going to happen here? What's going to happen that we're going to need to fucking move that stuff around? Why? 
Oh, these floorboards don't look right to me, boys. I don't know. Maybe it's just... Maybe I'm just going crazy. <laughs> oh, no. See, I knew it. Damn it. I knew it. Oh, dear. Trying to run past things just does not fucking work too in this game. Okay, can I? Sh can they climb? I'd be surprised if they can. Okay, I don't think they can. I said that'd be weird if they could. All right, time to heal. Did I fucking call it or what? Oh god, are these guys all gonna get up now and be zombies? I haven't got enough bullets for this room. Alright, come on, you guys. This is what I wanted. Let's try shooting him in the leg. You suggested. I shot her arm off by shooting her in the kneecap. Back up. Okay, well, I'm gonna leave those guys then. Let's go looking for ammo. And items. Nice. Got a sweet new knife, boys. Wait, what's this book over here? What's this about a book? Red book. Oh, this was the book that was being held by the uh, king guy. Drag this thing around. Something sounds a little slappy. No, okay, that's just them moving around still. You know what? This worked out well. I like this. Good job. Thank you very much. Oh, no. Oh, we need to fucking jack... Uh, okay. Well, we can't deal with this right now, then. They are much less intimidating in this state. <laughs> oh, it's the pony. Okay, what's... Okay, this is the unicorn, right? What's, what's the unicorns? It was, um... Okay, guys, Hi. hey. Nico, Daniel, stop. He ran right over here and they're fighting around me. <laughs> oh, where's my notebook? There it is. There it is, boys. Okay, so Pisces, Scorpio, Aquarius. I mean, not that we couldn't have guessed it anyway. It's not like there was that many combinations on this one. But I mean, it definitely saves us a hell of a lot of time. Ooh, more maps. Police station upper floors maps. Oh, yeah. There's, there's a lot of upper floors going on. here. The clock tower. Oh, no. Rather impressive statue to just kind of have out here. This police station is 
bonkers. It's so fucking big and opulent. It's crazy. Ah, oh, fuck. I don't got room for this shit. Um. Nah, I don't want to put anything down, so we're just going to have to leave this for now. We'll be back to this place, though. I'm sure. I'm sure. Oh, can I go back out into that main hall? I should probably go try that. St oh, look. There's the Stars office. That's where, uh... That's Chris Redfield and Jill Valentine. They're part of Stars, At least at this point. Oh, yep. Oh, we're gonna have to kill this guy now to get my fucking... This is fun. All right. I, assuming he doesn't despawn, uh, I guess I'll get that knife back later. Oh, I guess not, because this is locked. Ooh, cool, 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 cool. Oh, this is... Can they just not come through here? Maybe they're following you. Try moving down the hallway, maybe? What, down what hallway? Like over here, maybe? I yeah. guess. Mm. Oh. <laughs> uh, I feel like this plan has backfired. <laughs> well, I was expecting something like this to happen. <laughs> Run! Uh, you can't. You go into. You get cutscene attacked in this game. You get cutscene attacked, and there's just nothing you can do about it. Hey, stop, stop. No, you can't. I came to get my fucking knife from you! Oh, I hate this fucking game! These zombies are the most annoying pieces of shit ever! It, the game even gives me, like, a command on it saying, Hey, you can come pick this knife up, just so the guy can get a free cutscene hit on me. Oh, I hate this shit. Sorry, it's scary, it's cool, it's fun, I'm having a lot of fun, but the combat, I'm not gonna lie, it's really wearing on me at this point. It just feels like the game is trying to punish me for being smart. About, you know, how I'm going about this shit. Alright, here's the hipster lion. What did the hipster lion have? Lion, uh, olive branch, and uh, Boyd. Probably use some healing spray on him. I yes. think he's gonna be a zombie. I knew she'd make it. Oh, you know her? Yeah. Name's Claire. I came into town with her. You can get to that courtyard through the second floor, east side. <laughs> I'm on it. Thanks, Lieutenant. <laughs> so wow. Was right. This is very yeah, elaborate. The passage isn't open yet. Like th it's even done in <laughs> stages like this. 
<laughs> this is so weird. Oh, who made this? Uh, he may not have turned because he might be, like, he might also be correctly infected or at least someone whose body or physiology, biological makeup is compatible with the virus. Just like us. And that's what I'm assuming. But Yeah. Dave? Okay, what do we Red herbs. We're going. Ooh. So we got one key. We can use this to open up either the twos or the threes. And we can go take a look at that. Put shotgun shells away for now. And we'll put away the red book for now. So we find the pie that yeah, we're supposed to do that with. Do some of and we'll save. Oh, there's ammo. Okay, I see now what people are talking about. Because I looked up, when I looked up to see if the game was available for purchase on PS5, somebody said that the game looks and plays great, but they said in the police department, the sh the reflective surfaces in the main hall look like they were bugging big time. I can see now what they were talking about. Because, yeah, it does kind of look really weird. Like, look at the pillar, too. Does that get certain Ew. angles on it? I've been seeing that the whole time. Yeah, sh shiny surfaces... Are kind of messing up but other than that it does look kind of okay okay we can go through the spade door and back into the safety deposit room <laughs> okay is this guy getting back up because i didn't fucking Nail this guy like 50 times in the head. <clears throat> or how about this guy? His head's not exploded yet. Is he going to bite me right now? I just, I fucking... It's very upsetting to me. I'm sorry. I'm going to try not to let it bother me. Okay. What button? Okay. So this side out here is all twos. 203, we're not going to be able to get that until we get both keys. 208 we can get this but it's just it's just shotgun shells we still need to find a key card for the shotgun itself this side if we do a knife. okay so three will get us a knife two will get us a gunpowder it looks like or is that film it looks like film all right then let's do that one because that might be important 102. Yeah, see, it's it's letting us choose. We'll do two. Either way, this will still allow us to open up uh, 208. Oh, it's gun tower. Don't do it. It's fine, because there's also 208 on the other side. Nothing we're doing is... We, we're going to need both keys to be able to get anything spectacular. We're fine. I mean, honestly, gunpowder or knife, I really don't care at this point. I want story stuff. I want inventory increase. I want to get out of this police station. <laughs> don't have a club's key. West office. All right, um, let's go combine some gunpowder to make bullets. Posit our shells. God damn it. Combine. Um... Well, 
okay, I actually think we can get rid of the spades key now because I don't think there's anything else we need a spades key for that we're aware of, at least. Um, and I just feel it's weird that they would give us because we basically got to a point where the game had to give us the spades key. So I don't think we're going to be needing it necessarily anymore. I don't know. Maybe I'm just God damn. Second second floor. And maybe try to get out there. Library, we need to find the why is everything in weird parts? Like, why is there a jack there, but there's no pole for the jack? You know, you gotta jack the pole and shit. Pole jacker. Right, second floor, here we come. Oh, it, it, are these my footsteps, by the way, or are these just footsteps? You got anything new to say to me? I wonder if the game will let me shoot him. Oh, hold on. I think it does. I think it does like stop me from aiming at him. Yeah, it won't let me shoot him. <laughs> it does that in uh, Resident Evil Village too. I know. Like if you try to aim your gun at the Duke, it'll automatically uh, point the gun away from him. I liked the Duke a lot. He was a cool guy. And I'm pretty sure he has like an elaborate backstory that they hint at and never confirm. And I really like that about him. Not to mention he saved my bacon. Gave me great customer service. Oh great, another safe. Well, keep your eye out for uh, combinations, I guess. Guide pamphlet. Welcome to Raccoon City. Did you know, while we are the home of pharmaceutical giant Umbrella Corporation, Raccoon City is a vibrant and dynamic city with a long, rich history of its own. In this guide, we'll introduce you to just a few of the more unusual points of interest our city has to offer. The Raccoon City Police Station. The building in the center of town wasn't always a police station. In fact, it used to be an art museum. Well, that explains a lot, actually. Various features like the unusual clock tower and the goddess statue in the main hall remind us of a bygone era. The Orphanage. What is up with this guide pamphlet? Don't they have any better, like, tourism spots? Just a few blocks from the police station is an orphanage founded and run by the Umbrella Corporation with the help of generous donations from businesses and citizens alike. The building is known for its stained glass window, which attracts visitors from all around the world. Unfortunately, they are not adopting, though, <laughs> when they visit. Come to Raccoon City. Visit our police station and orphanage. <laughs> Motherfuckers. <sighs> okay. You know what? I, gra okay, yeah. Granted, that's on me. That's on me. I, I'll, you know, I'll take the L on that one. Oh, Miko is so feisty tonight right now. All right, and you know what? I keep seeing all these ferns around, and I keep I keep getting them uh, mixed up and confused with <laughs> with herbs and shit. Like, and, and, and by that I mean I'm not picking up herbs because of them. Take out the key. Sorry for the angle there, boys. I was playing one-handed. <laughs> it would be nice to have a key ring, though, but okay, I guess. <sighs> Why do you want me to organize items? Stop that. Go away. <sighs> you 
you know what? I'm not. I'm just like not even caring any <laughs> about. I'm just going to ignore that helicopter crash into part of our building. Please tell me the stacks. Okay, good. And of course, we need a crank. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, video game logic. Oh, okay, discarding key items. Uh, red check mark means that they've served all their purpose. That's okay. That's actually good. I like that. Now I can say, I don't bye need bye this key. fucking key anymore. Yep. Goodbye, bye bye key. key. I like that they did that. Then again, just in case, I'm going to put it in storage. You can't tell me what to do. You're not my dad. Anyway, video game logic. Two piles of boards take up as much space as a single key. That doesn't make sense. Video game logic. And I need the fucking book. Hmm. Perfect. Raccoon Magazine. Art article, The Red Stone. The ruby that captivated Edward, the Black Prince. The pearl that the Queen of the Nile milked dry. The diamond that led a queen to the guillotine. There is no end to the number of tales related to the appeal of jewels. This mysterious red stone is simply the latest to sparkle among them. Like those other jewels, this one's origin is unknown. It's said that it once adorned a noblewoman's jeweled box and was even dedicated to a wise king. This fall, this fall, this stone that's long been shrouded in legend will be on display during auction. There are sure to be many eager enthusiasts there but dear reader one would do well to approach with care for devilry lies in beauty shadow this jewel has turned caring nobles who love their subjects into despots more terrible than caligula and we have the tales to prove it Seriously, it's precisely because these jewels are bathed in blood that their luster stirs something in the hearts of people everywhere This fall, Rob Schneider <laughs> is Leon Kennedy. Ah, oh, fuck yeah, boys. We're getting a shotgun. We're getting a shoddy. We're Leon Kennedy, so we'll be a hottie with a shoddy. Left statue's left arm. Fun, okay. So that's the jewel, right? That's the red jewel that they've been talking about. <clears throat> oh, we'll get it, boys. I don't know what we're going to do with it. I don't know what the red jewels need. There's no, okay, there's no way that the famed red jewel is going to be a, like, an item for a puzzle in the police station. Oh, I'm so tired of making this this run. <laughs> she got her what bejeweled. <laughs> her I think they said it was her Caligula. <laughs> I know. Nasty. Uh, let's go. Let's go get that shotgun. If we're gonna go get the shotgun, let's grab the shotgun shells first. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It would also be nice if we could turn on the lights. Whatever, I guess. It's fine. It's, it's whatever. Okay. Gonna get my shotgun. Oh, yeah. Oh, now we've got some major firepower. I'm talking mm, pump action.
Now the question becomes, do I... Okay, first off, the game's going to attack me, right? Like, I'm going to go out that door and I'm going to get jumped by zombies because I just got a shotgun. That's how these games uh. always work. Um, anyway. Oh, blah, blah, blah. What was over here again? It was just the safe, right? Just a safe, no... No light switches, no light switches. Why would they put light switches in a police department? That doesn't even make sense. Come on, awkward. You're heading the game. What are you? What are you thinking? Okay, we're gonna use the book and the arm, so those will be out of my inventory. I want to keep the boards, the ammo. Okay, yeah, we're good. But I should save. Especially since Leon's looking a little rough around the edges lately. But I don't want to use the green herb by itself. I want to combine it first. Alright, so what are your thoughts, boys? Should I... Which should I... Should I use up pistol ammo before I switch to my shotgun? maybe try to save the shotgun for when I go up against tougher enemies or should I yeah yeah we'll do that we'll 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 keep with pistol until shotgun becomes required or unless we're going up against yeah like a boss we'll do that later. all right old worn book combine with arm then come oh sorry then use to be honest it looks like we could have just slipped it out of the hand anyway oh maybe not because there is that little lip there the scepter all right a short staff with a jewel in it Find three medallions. Okay. Oh my gosh. Sorry guys for the noises you're hearing. The dogs are playing a lot right now. Ooh, ooh, ooh. What's this? There's the red jewel, boys. It's pricey looking. I don't... I Is there a store in this game? Are we going to be asked what we're buying and what we're selling? Is the duke here? God, I hope the Duke's here. No, I know he's not. Ooh wee. Look at that. Okay, I'm in the yellow, so I don't want to use this yet anyway. But we will be combining it. And once I hit red, boom, baby. Gonna heal up. Where are we? Might as well give it a try. Okay, that did work. Oh yeah, this is like out where she was at, wasn't it, or something? Oh, there's the fucking helicopter. <laughs> Leon? Claire, hold on, I'll be right there. Let's okay. keep yelling. It definitely won't call zombies. Like right there. Oh, if that's a zombie, he's a flaming zombie. Damn it, that makes him even stronger. It's so nice to see you. How are you doing? That helicopter just came out. Are they fucking own. flirting? Oh my god, what's going on here? I'm guessing you don't have a key in one of those fancy pockets? Uh, unfortunately, no. Mm. But how are you doing? Hey, how you doing? You know, oh my god, start driving. flirting. That's good. <laughs> I, this is Lucky fucking hard to watch. No, not yet. Claire. Don't lose hope. I'm sure we're gonna find him. <laughs> Damn it. You know what that means? Yeah. Dinner time. Climb over the gate! Claire, I think you should go. Don't worry about me, Leon. You take care of yourself. Claire, you need to go. Now! Okay. Let's get through this. Both of us. <laughs> he was big. 
Okay. Uh, Marvin, I've got a situation here. I'm surrounded by zombies. Nice. Cutting tool. Why don't they just call it a bolt cutter? Marvin, do you copy? Who knows what that's what it is? Marvin! Damn it. Oh, can I go down there? No, it won't let me. Can I go back up this way, though? Huh. Oh, fuck! Fuck, fuck, fuck! <laughs> There's a reason why I'm being fucking tag teamed by goddamn. Zombies on fire? Holy shit nuggets. Oh my god. I hate these zombies. Fuck you guys. I... I totally called that the fucking zombies were gonna be on fire and it was gonna make them more dangerous. Uh, if you missed it, uh, we met up with Claire Redfield out here. The helicopter that crashed into the building blew up. Fire alarm's going off. The zombies are going crazy because the fire alarm. And they had a really awkward, super long fucking, like, flirt session through the fence. This is the guy from the beginning that came after me. Okay, that looked like a dying animation, right? I'm not crazy. Motherfucker, you best be goddamn dead. All right, I'm gonna take a look around. Fire, safe door. I just want to get new eyes in here since, you know, it's been a while. Oh, cool. Cool, cool. Oh my god! Good, we can use these now. Dink. Um. <laughs> Freeze frame. <laughs> Say cheese. No, that's exactly what this game is. Is that is that Jen who said that? Because that sounds like. Sounds like so that sounds like somebody being empathetic and not like saying I suck. So that sounds like Jen, maybe. Oh, okay. But okay, okay. I'm not crazy though, right? Like like nothing in this game stays dead. You try to get those headshots in and they Oh, hello. Oh, I like that guy. Hell yeah, I like that guy. Equip in the inventory screen to use, guaranteed to daze and stun enemies within its effective radius. Uh, can be used to counterattack when you are caught by an enemy, but its effectiveness is greatly reduced. Hey, that's just like in um, Dead by Daylight. You, I believe Leon has a... I think he has an ability where you can like drop a flashbang. You get like grabbed by the... Uh... Don't like Why can't I board up this window? Can I not board up this window because there's a radiator in front of it? Probably. So annoying. Okay, but does that hold? I'm assuming not because, you know, it's this game. It's nothing. Yeah, nothing in nothing this game is, is fucking permanent. 
Yeah, that's what I thought. Cause I I I remember getting flash banged by uh, Leon. High grade gunpowder. Oh, there's the electrical part, but mm, can't pick that up. We're gonna come back for this. I can move this now. Oh, cool. Oh my god! <laughs> Why does it keep weaving? Oh my god, I wasted so much ammo there. Alright, I'm just trying to get to your head. They, they go to walk and they're just like... Gunpowder. Oh, you know, we can combine this for more shotgun shells. Uh, here we go. But yeah, I'm pretty sure then it's because of this game that they gave Leon that that ability in um, Dead by Daylight. I thought maybe it was going to turn on the lights over on this side, but I guess not. I'd really like some lights. You know what I mean? Nah, man. Ooh, hello. What's that? Yes, please. Is Am I crazy, or is he actually, like, placing random uh, equipment around here for me to find? It's true. I do like that. Very nice of him. Oh, God. I need fucking hurry space. I'm thinking for now I'm going to put the shotgun away. Mm. I've got lots of bullets. I'm going to keep this other stuff on me. Okay. All right. Did you save? No, I'm going to save now. I'm going to I'm going to deal with inventory before I save. That way if I die, I don't have to deal with inventory <laughs> That's again. That's true. Exactly. All right, everybody. I'm going to go hit the restroom real fast cuz I got a piss. So don't go nowhere. We got more spooky, spooky um, Resident Evil 2 plus me raging at zombies coming right up.
Okay, you know what? I like that. I like that theory you've got. <laughs> that's a good theory. That's a that's a solid theory at this point. This is all just a really elaborate hazing ritual <laughs> to welcome the newest member of the Raccoon City <laughs> Police Department. <laughs> Okay, so uh, real quick, everybody, want to remind you, I am live, YouTube, Twitch. Give me a follow on Twitch. That would help out a lot. And we're doing Resident Evil 2. PS4 version being played on the PS5. Definitely, definitely the scariest Resident Evil game I've played in a, in a long time, it feels like to me. They somehow give me a shotgun and a pistol and a combat knife. What's this noise? Yeah, they somehow... My listen. What am I hearing? Yes, like I said, they somehow give me a bunch of weapons, and yet I feel like there's nothing I can do to fight things still. Oh, no. Oh, no. You hate to see still it. Alive. Okay. <laughs> yeah, no, still. Okay, uh, so. We don't have the other key for that. We did get the wheel crank. So that's nice. Uh, where did that go again? That went for the second floor. I don't think this spot. Hmm. Where was it? Was it up there? Shower room. That's where it was, I think. Yeah, it's where the valve needs. Okay. Shower room. We can get there through the west office. Press room, bathroom. Those were all dead ends. We couldn't do anything with those. What's this blank spot here? I don't think I could do anything. But it just has a blank opening, so I don't know. Whatever, we're going to go to the valve spot. I'm totally ready for one of these guys that I killed forever ago to just get up, like, two hours later. Yeah, I don't know, like... Oh. Bitch. Oh my god. Even on the ground they just roll over. What the God damn it. I'm turning damn this it. person's head into fucking pulp. Speaking of people getting up, that person was the one that was, like, laying here for a long time. Okay. The locker room. Yeah, at least we can take a shower now, though, huh? Ah, never mind. No showers for us. I ain't taking a cold shower. Fuck that. Water heater's broken. Well, I want to see if it said anything. Like, he should have been like, Ooh, that's brisk. Or maybe, like, uh, get some of this blood off or something. I don't know. Something. I'm sure a lot of toothbrushes are in there. Okay, well... That guy's definitely, like, alive. Or un undead. Alright, I, I, he did not react. So we can all... We can all be annoyed together when he attacks me as I walk by him. Also, I liked how the game made a big deal about those liquors, but then, like, I never got attacked by one. Maybe if I was running around the attic, one would have come out, but... Ooh, how how heavy is Leon? 
Ah, boo. Green herb. No, it's just plants. Yeah. <sighs> God, it was a lot of fun, though. Oh, I'm sensing maybe we'll have some more. I'm, maybe there's a chance for liquors here then. I'm also guessing for the most part, if you see a cor like if there's a corpse missing a leg, it's probably not going to attack you. Because they're going to want their zombies to be able to get up and do something. Oh no, look at there's scratches on the walls and shit. I'm thinking boys, liquors maybe. What in God's name? Oh yeah. <laughs> oh there it is. Okay, so here's the star's office, right. Special tactics and rescue service. Oh, that's why they call him a liquor, all right. That tongue, man, does not fit in that fucking body, huh? Maybe is your, uh, mic uh, on? No, I, for I forgot. Kind of cool looking, though. I like how their brain is on the outside. That's fun. Their outside skeletons. Yeah, they're like weird inside out people. That booty, though. Oh, look, he's got a little tailbone. Oh, that's cute. Oh, it's like a corgi. Can I open this door without being attacked? Okay, good, I can. Okay. Battery. <laughs> Nine volt battery by Ropeway. I wonder why they called it brand Ropeway. That's gotta mean something to somebody. Internal memo. September 22nd, 1998. Officer Supply Internal Relocation Notice. Heat resistant three number combination safe. Moved from Star's office, second floor, to West office, first floor. The combo is left nine, right 15, left seven. Left Nine. Please change the combo Nine. ASAP upon receipt, RPD Left. Facility Maintenance Department. Hey. Finally, we get, get to use one of these safes. Whose office is this, anyway? Is there a name on the door? No? Okay. Because, I mean, Chris's office is totally in here, right? Maybe Jill's? Ooh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What are here? Count authentication, account authentication is required. Insert your dongle key into the USB port. Okay, so that's what we got to do there. Oh, is that another firearm in there? Maybe an upgraded handgun? Maybe it won't take, s like, eight shots to the head to kill something, finally. Basic bitch zombies. Made in heaven. Is this Chris's desk? Bunch of CDs. Nothing helping me, that's for sure. Ooh, health pack. Yes. Oh, we can't stack them? That's lame. I can stack all sorts of other stuff. 
Hold on. Oh, it's a raccoon. Okay, because I couldn't see what it was before. Keep your ears out for those gut things, boys. Armory is locked. And we're basically done in here, except for the red herb. Something that's nice to note, though, it looks like... Okay, cool. When we do find stuff, but don't pick it up, it does show up on the map. So that's that's real nice of them. I like that. A dial lock. Okay, we don't know how to get into that still. Here's the jack. I say let's go open up that safe. Well, you know, it wouldn't be a bad idea necessarily to grab some of those handcuffs, right? If we can. Never know when that might come in handy. Okay, so there's liquor running around up in the ventilation shaft now. Oh, this is messy. <gasps> Rega does not like the liquor. That was fun. That was cool. That was a good spook. See, that was awesome. That was a good spook, but it allowed me to actually do something instead of just get my ass kicked. And we need the diamond key. Awesome. Cool, 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 cool. What was on the other side of this place? Oh, great. Are these guys still at this fucking door? Oh, no, that's right. I... You killed I, them. Yeah, that's right. I went about... Sh I went on a shooting spirit with them. Um. Although, it sounds like there's... Okay, one of them's still... Yeah, one of them's still kicking. Uh, I don't have the jack. So... Leaving that alone. We don't have the what we need to explode the barricade. Don't have the dial. Can't get over there because we don't have the jack. Okay. Mm -hmm. We just gotta go ahead and leave. All right, so we're gonna have to kill this guy at some point, right? He's going to turn though, and we're gonna have to shoot him. Like that's not even. No one's questioning that, right? Like that we all we're all pretty sold on that point. All on the same page, I think. Shit ton of red herbs, man. We just need some blue ones now. I wanna keep this on me because I just know we're gonna need it at some point. Good for now. Let's go open up that safe, boys and girls. Hmm, two, two hours and 13 minutes. It feels like I've been playing this game for like six hours already. Okay, it was right nine. Damn it. Wait, is this turning it to the right or is this turning? No, it's far. okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Right nine. It was fucking left nine. Hold on. God damn it. Left nine. Right fifteen. Left seven. Yeah, okay, it worked. <gasps> oh, it's another fanny pack.
Does it show them on me? I don't think it does. Okay, I gotta get out of this room to get a good look because it's gonna... When you're in flashlight mode, you're like locked behind Leon. Once I'm out here, now I can... I should be able to turn around. Yeah. No, they don't show the hip pouches. That's lame. I do have handcuffs, though, I saw there. Yeah, dude's totally gonna turn on me. Yeah. Oh my god, there we go. Um... Now what do we do? Let's go over what we got. Item box in there, that's fine. Type fighter. Dark room sink, but we haven't had the need for anything. Any other pictures yet. We don't have the key. Oh, we don't have the button for that. We don't have the key for this. Ooh, I do like the way it shows the windows that you've boarded up, though. That's nice. Uh, we can't figure out how to open this thing up. At least as far as I know. Which means there's no way to get to this other area back here yet. Floor 2. Don't have the key. I probably should have picked up that gunpowder. That's okay. I'm not going to go for that right now. Dial lock. Don't know the combo. PC. I need the dongle. Waiting room. Safe. I don't know the combo. We need a crank handle here, but we don't have... This is all on fire. There's a flaming zombie in here that's still alive that's got my knife stuck in its fucking neck. That's fun. On over here, we can't get out into this area because I don't I don't have the jack for right here. We don't have the combination for this dial lock. We don't have the explosive for here. Fuck, what are we supposed to do? Like, no, I'm actually at a point where I'm like, I don't know the way forward. Let's go back into this section then. I want to look at this door. And I don't know, maybe go take a look at this thing again. Oh, this is open. Okay, it got busted open. That's probably where that guy came from. That that one fat cop that got off me. Okay. What's in here? Please tell me it's going to help me. Ford. I mean, I'll take them for sure, but... Bullet. I'll take them. Uh, I was looking for something more than just a little supply closet. All right. Um, That's... You know what? Every little bit helps. Every little bit helps. We're just gonna. You okay, baby? Jesus! They're everywhere! Wait, what? Was that was that me? Was that somebody else saying that? Why why was he saying that? I don't I guess. Okay, wait. Maybe I can do something with this door, though. I can look through it. That's about it. All right. We can head back to the bathroom, maybe. Okay, so this was the bathroom that was flooding in the toilet. That's why all the water's everywhere. But, I mean, otherwise it's not really helping us. We've boarded up all the windows that we can. For some reason, this window doesn't need boarding, so... 
I mean, I guess that's just how that goes. This is the part here that's making all sorts of noise. This guy here was, uh, was it Elliot, we said? Yeah, we think it's Elliot. So this just says, fire safety door, do not obstruct. Okay, we ain't able to do anything with it. We can head back outside now. Is there anything I could do with this? Besides, I guess just... Wow, okay. Bulletproof glass. Bulletproof glass that apparently zombies can smash through. Zombies. Oh my god, will you fucking just die already? Okay, he better be goddamn dead. I ain't shooting him no more. Wasting so many goddamn bullets. Not that I'm aware of. I can try shooting it, but I don't think it's going to do anything. I picked up a round handle, but that's not the handle for this crank here. Oh, fuck. Oh, that's the guy with my knife in his, in his chest. <laughs> Sweet, I got my knife back. And I see they stopped being on fire. Yeah, see, because the, the round handle was just for the shower area. I don't have a crank for this. Uh, was there any other locked doors that I need the bolt cutters for, now that I'm thinking about it? You know what? Yeah, let's go back, because, okay, that's that's what I think. I think that's what I'm missing. Some of the, a, a couple of these locked doors, I think, did have the chains. So I should be able to cut them with the bolt cutters. That's what I'm missing. Make sure you have the space for it. Space for what? Whatever you're planning to go get. Oh no, I no the bolt cutters. I already have them. I'm, what I'm gonna go do right now is I'm gonna go check out. How many boards do I have? Because, yeah, no, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go, um... I'm going to go back down to this hallway. Because <clears throat> there's locked doors around here that I think have chains that I can... Specifically, I want to go check this one. Because this was a jump through, a window up near the ceiling, so I can't go back the other way. That's what that arrow means. And the game totally wants me to go down this spooky hallway again. Now with liquors, though, so keep an eye out for that fun addition. Yeah, look, they've got vents too here. If I can make it over there, I can probably board. I might be able to board that up. Nope. Nope. Uh, there we go. Trying to get the angle on this angle. 
Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm just not gonna go near him. And board. Stay down, asshole. Oh, I'm seeing liquor scratches. Shit. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> yeah, hold on. Oh, let me go get the shotgun, I guess. I guess with that last uh, inventory pouch I picked up, we could probably just go ahead and keep both weapons on us full time. Yeah, might as well take these out and combine them just so we got more ammo while I'm at it. But yeah, game totally wanted me to go back down this hallway. Oh, fuck me! I didn't think they were gonna be here already. I'm guessing that's the last of mine. Oh my god. What the? <laughs> Rika is not having a good time over there. <laughs> yeah, fuck this section of the building, man. This is all fucking just nothing but unsecure windows oh look there's another one coming up here awesome oh fuck me Okay, let's see. Do I? Okay, I got. I got to heal at this point. I'm not sure if they can open that door. I'm assuming they can. Well, actually, I don't know. See, I can't. I don't know if zombies can open doors in this game, or what. Whatever. See, it was worth it going down this this hallway at least. The detonator. Electronic gadget. Oh yeah, we know what this is for. A medium-sized electronic gadget. Locker room. Oh, here we go, here we go. Locker room CAP, guys. Oh, Borg. Locker room CAP. Somebody write that down. CAP. Locker room CAP. Okay, so now we need the heart key for this. What is in this room of records? Can we need the heart key and the fucking uh, club key? Oh, there is a uh, herb right there. And a flashbang. Okay. Go ahead and unlock this. Okay, locker room. It was locker room, right? Yes, CAP. Shower room. Where was the lock? Unless the locker room was talking about that shower room. I think so, because there was a dial lock up. Oh, yeah, we got to go back out that way anyway. Oh, 
There's our friend who's just constantly outside. Okay. C A P. Ha! <laughs> nice. And it was just some shotgun shit. Oh well, we've got the ability to blow the door up here now, so let's go do that. And there's def gonna be some liquor activity up here. You can bet your asses. It's might be it, things might get real. Oh, look at the way they do that there. They're like, oh yeah, you want some, you want some boobies? I'm in this room and get some boobies off this bald woman. And you go around the corner and you're like, ah, oh, it's just a little bald woman statue. Ah, oh, shucks. Okay, I'm going to go into creep mode here. Go into creep mode, look around this fucking corner. Oh, we up in like the fucking attic, boys. Oh, look, there's that hole up there. That's so that the liquors can crawl in and out of this room. You just fucking watch. Like I said, look at all that poop. Oh, I remember that guy hanging upside down. Oh, it's so spooky. Oh, there's no noises, boys. It's so scary in here. That's the last medallion. Oh my god, fucking Daniel, stop. That's the fucking last medallion in there. But then we're going to have to go do stuff to get um, uh, Claire. So we won't be able to leave right away. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Do I have to, like, hold on. Do I have to, like, maybe arm this or something first? I've got to combine the battery with it. There we go. Ah. <sighs> God, okay, just a moment, guy. I really wish the dogs would stop messing around. Daniel, Daniel hey. hey! Oh, they're so loud. These doggies. Ten seconds. Oh, we got trapped in this room. And here come the liquors. I called it, boys. Mm. The way that blast knocked over that shelf was pretty was pretty cool from like a game. Like a game aspect there. I I did very much appreciate that. <sighs> Sounds like liquors are fighting up in the attic, but it's just... It's just my dogs. Alright, what was the... Just a moment, boys. Be right back. Sorry about that, boys. I need to be able to concentrate on this fucking game. 
And these dogs are making it so like I literally can't hear anything. Third Michelada. The final Michelada. Move my cans around and back to it. Okay, so we got woman, arrow, a bow and arrow, and snake. Woman, arrow, and snake. Look at them try to be like sneaky with this one. Oh, it's so complicated. The maiden medallion. And here they come. Uh, is there? There's no way out of them. This side is there. No, of course there's not. So we got to get out into the. No, we can't go in the library. We got to go back out to this way again. Remember that hole in the ceiling? I told you that's the liquor's gonna be able to come from this room out into the hallway while we try to get out of here. Oh my God, that's not a liquor. Oh, that's the guy that was hanging upside down, probably. Shotgun should be powerful enough. I shouldn't have to shoot him three times in the head. Ah, oh, what the fuck? All right, fine. You want to fucking play? Oh no, I was I was about to throw a. Sh you know, I was about to do something stupid there. Oops. Oh my gosh. Uh, here we go. Heal. Yes, use that. Run. I think it's dead. But that doesn't mean there's not going to be more. But if there are, I want to be quiet, not run like crazy. Um, I wasn't expecting him to drop down and just know where I was. Oh, okay. I can. Come on, Leon. Oh, you can do it, boy. Okay, I guess the point, though, was that you weren't going to be able to do that if you had... Um, if you had the liquor on your ass. That was a, you have to kill the liquor to be able to get through this thing. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Are you fucking kidding me? He's at the bottom of the goddamn ladder. Okay, cool. <laughs> at this point, I don't even fucking care anymore. Okay, awesome. How far away is he? Okay, he's far enough away. I'm going to grab this gunpowder real quick. You know, I should just kill him, but at this point... This one, he's like a he's like a pet, like a little family dog in there. All right, I got all three medallions. Time for this guy to come alive and attack my ass. Oh, so safe. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Oh, you have a first aid spray. I do. I'm in a pretty rough shape right now. Uh, store that. Keep these fine. Matilda. <sighs> What's my health looking like color wise here? I can look down. I'm at yellow. Okay. Oh, just take the green herb then. Yeah, right now I'm just going to walk around holding my. I'm just going to hold my side for a bit. I'm fine. It doesn't actually affect gameplay, so. As far as I know. Finally, there it is, boys. The secret passage. We don't want to say anything to him? Alright, secret passage is open. So it goes underground. That's it. Here it comes. Here it comes. Our way out. Here it comes. Here's his, here Get he is. Up. Marvin. Oh, I thought he was just going to come at me from Time behind. Hey, Marvin. Ah! We 
need to get you to a hospital right now. No. He's no, turning, dude. Save yourself. Come on, I've got you. Go! He knows. We can still make it out of here together. We just can... It's too late. He knows. Yeah. I tried, Leon. But I couldn't stop it. He's gonna shoot himself. We can't let this thing spread. It's on you now. Just go. Oh, Marvin. I understand. Let you down, Marvin. I was not expecting to be leaving the police station. There's so much more to do in here, though. Interesting. Okay. I, I was. It might be under Claire. You could do all those other stuff. You know, maybe. Oh, look, it's the it's a little model of the of the building. So big. I think it used to be an art museum, so that it makes sense. I like that they put that in. Uh, Unicorn and a lion. Ah. <gasps> oh, I think maybe we can get back into the police station then using this. Maybe. Well, there's a safe point. Ooh, can I wear a hat? No. Why would they let me wear a hat? Stupid carrot. Can you combine red herbs and green herbs? Uh, I believe so, but I don't want to do that. Because I want to combine the red herbs with the blue herbs, because it's supposed to increase my constitution. Mm. But I might be able to do green and red for, like, another type of heal. I don't know. All right, back to Matilda and my pistol. A pistola. Me pistola, I should say. This is a cool little, I like this little office. I mean, it's a bitch to try to unlock your office, that's for sure, but <laughs> you gotta go around and collect medallions <laughs> and open up the fucking... Open up the fucking goddess statue. Every time I see elevators like this, I just think they're so dangerous. Do not get your fingers or limbs near these... These, uh... <laughs> panels here, you know? With the way there's just, like, a grate that you could... Something could poke out on accident. Oof, I'm not a fan of that. Oh yeah, I grabbed the green herb because I was thinking about using it, but now I was like, nah, let's just keep just keep on keeping on like we are. Mm. Okay, I can go that way, but what's down here? A little bit further down. Ooh. Oh, that's cool. Equipping the inventory screen to use. Guaranteed to kill enemies within its blast radius. <clears throat> okay, so it's greatly reduced if we use it uh, defensively. Oops. Fucking cool. I like that. That's awesome. Yeah, no, that's... That's going to be a no. Which is what I thought, that down there we weren't going to be able to get through. What the, what the fuck is that noise? Who's causing all that ruckus? 
Better not be messing with my generators. Oh, that's the wrong game. <laughs> Speaking though, these these are actually generators. These are steam powered generators right here. Oh, this place looks like it's hell. I'm still gonna be chased in this area by Mr. X. Watch. He's finally gonna appear. He's gonna be chasing me all over this fucking room. You can see it now. Oh god. I'm so not looking forward to Mr. X. There we go. Oh! Okay, well that's not Mr. X. Who the fuck is this? Am I supposed to know who this is? Oh, that's a big eye. I'm seeing a weak point. Pretty sure that if he's crushing me against that. Wait, where'd the eye go? I swear he had a big ol' eye. Okay, well, not Mr. X, but I called that this big ol' room I was gonna be running around in. Now is not the time. That herb. Oh boy. All right, we got to figure out what to do here. Oh, I'm a running boys. I'm a running. Oh, what's this? Okay. And I'm stuck and he's coming. Oh boy. Oh, am I supposed to? Okay, I think I have to kill him then. Some items can be combined with other items. Either to free up a slot or create something. Okay, yeah, I know about combining items. Holy shit. I mean, like, for real though, right? Like, like, I, I just, I've already ran around this place now. I didn't see anything to do to get out of here, so we're just going to need to, oh, I see the cutting tool can now be discarded, which I won't do. I'm gonna put it in the uh, storage, just in case, just. <laughs> You know, I just want to point out. Oh, there it is. There's the eye. Oh, shit, shit, shit. Ah, oh, fuck me. Okay. Rick is having a fun time. All right, what else do I got? Nothing really. Oh, 
Okay, well, boys, I've got some bad news. Oh, hold on. This helps. This helps. Where's he coming from? Oh, there he is. Oh. Come on, pop, pop! Or that, okay. I guess. Wow, Leon, that was a weird noise. What the fuck is that? For no fucking reason? Okay. Okay, well, okay. You know what? I, I'll, I'll give him that then. If he says that, then it's like, all right, they acknowledge that somebody had to have knocked that down. Okay, okay. Oh, man, we should have forklifted that guy. Oh. Hey, first boss fight down, everybody. Didn't die. Easier than the flame lurker. <laughs> True. True. I, at one point, I, I could have sworn I was going to die at one point. When he had me in that corner, oh, <laughs> he was you just... had your head? Yeah, he, he had my head in his oh, hand. Combine the green herbs. Yeah, he had my head in his hand, and he was about to, like, just bust the shit out of me. I could tell he was about to. He was going to squish my fucking little. Uh, you think we could go save? Oh, well, I can't go back to where I was before, so. See? Oh. New area here. Why would you even need this? Like, <laughs> what purpose does it serve to be able to just disconnect the bridge? Not to mention, we couldn't get up here anyway, so I don't really see what, like, why they even put this in the game. It's not like we were like, oh, we can't get by, we can't get by because the, the bridge is out. <laughs> Okay, here we go. Nice, safe room. Oh, nice. Oh, another pouch. Oh, so good. I, I, I love getting those Hyper things now. Oh, it's a save point. <laughs> yeah, that's what, I, that's what I said, baby. Uh, More red herbs. Oh, I can store that and that. Or these things for now. All righty, onwards, my boys, to more zombies. Yeah, hey, water heater that wasn't broken. Oh, we passed. This is the ladder. We passed it. We passed the question mark. And this is the parking garage. Yeah. Those scribbles in that notebook were all correct. Did I just hear a fucking wolf howl? Why did yeah. I hear a wolf howl? There. Okay, okay, I was about to say there's no werewolves in... I was about to say there's no werewolves in Resident Evil, but one, uh, it's probably like undead dogs, like zombie dogs. And two, uh, Resident Evil Village actually did have werewolves, so... <laughs> okay, so that's locked. Out. Oh, this is great. This is just what I want.
Careful, shutter may cause serious injury or death. But not for me. Oh, great. Damn. Oh, there it is. Oh no. There it is, boys. You gotta be kidding me. Get off of me! Oh man. There we go. Finally a friend. Hey, was it Claire? Oh no. Is it it's Jill Valentine? No. It's uh Ada. Ada? Oh Ada Wong. Yep. Lower it. FBI. Sorry. Thank you. For your help. Even the dogs need to get shot multiple times in the head. Surprised you made it this far. FBI, huh? What's going on here? Sorry. Yeah. That information's classified. Where are you going? Do yourself a favor. Stop asking questions and get the hell out of here. They're very cagey about this and the way she looks and everything, but I, I'm pretty sure it's Ada. Hey, I'm not done talking to you. And now it's open because it has a green light above it. And this one's locked because it has a red light. Who's got the little fucking Mini Cooper <laughs> in the police station? All right. They should totally let us do something with these. And by these, I mean like these vending machines. Let a man get some snacks, you know what I mean? Oh, can't go that way. There's a couch in the way, boys. Okay. Uh, was that a key card we needed for this? Wait, okay, it's probably something we're gonna have to just unlock from the other side. Because it wasn't showing us, like, a lock, you know, a little key card thing. Firing range. Interesting. I see something to shoot at. Okay, okay. A message from Mr. Raccoon. Howdy, boys and girls. It's your pal from Raccoon City Zoo. It's always great to see you. Today, I want to talk about something really important to me. You know my popular Mr. Raccoon toys? Well, I heard some bad kids have been using them for target practice, but that makes me really sad. Good little kids wouldn't be that mean, right? Plus, it's super, super dangerous, so just don't do it. Anyway, see you at the zoo. Mr. Raccoon out. Yeah, we got it, game. Shoot, shoot the little bobblehead, guys. We got it. You don't gotta tell us. Alright. Uh, these guys are gonna get up and attack me, probably. I wonder if I'll get something if I shoot those targets. And I'm getting here now. Before those guys get up. Oh, should I do it? Oh, I don't want to waste ammo, but I'll do it. 
Just to see if it gives me anything. Uh, it, it won't. That's okay. This is for me, then. Yeah, it's just for me. Diamond key. Gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Ooh, a box. <laughs> Equipment disposal notice. Item to be disposed. Key to patrol car 7439. That specific four digit number is a little unnerving to me. 7439. Mm. Yeah, that's, that's a four digit number that's in my life in a certain place. Details. Bent key, no longer usable, but can still open the car's doors and trunk with its keyless entry buttons. Examine. And it's... I don't know why they just didn't give me the, the key. Okay. They really want to make me fiddle with stuff. Hold on. What's up with that? What's up with that? More doggos? <laughs> I heard you, Senor. <laughs> yeah, it's more fucking doggos. Okay, hold up. We're gonna be dealing with fucking doggos. I'm gonna be... I'm gonna be not fucking around. Also, let's go check out that patrol car I talked about. Hmm. Which patrol car was it? Okay, two, three, six. That's not it. This one? Can I just use this? There we go. That was. It's kind of cool, though. I liked doing that examine. Here we go. Gunstock for Matilda. Oh, I don't know. Damn it. That's so weird. I don't. Am I crazy? Or do pistols with gun stocks just look really fucking weird? <laughs> I just, I don't, I don't like it. Three rounds per pull of the trigger. That. <laughs> yeah, I know. Now look, like if I go back to it now. Yeah, I, I, it's like a, it's like a pistol rifle. I don't. It looks ridiculous. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm not a fan of it. There's other games too that have that put stocks on pistols that I've played, and it's just, I just think it looks real dumb every time. I don't care if it's actually something that like exists and is good and true. It just looks funny. Um, but I'm going to be switching to shotgun because dogs, this is a much wider spread and dogs are always annoying to shoot with accuracy. So I can hear him. I hear dim puppies. <gasps> blue herb, blue herb, blue herb. Ooh, the blue herb looks nice. Looks kind of like those plants we saw in the grocery store tonight. Earlier. Mm -hmm. Yep, here's the fucking kennels. Oh no, I hear the growly. Lord on a hunter, I hear the zombies growling. Got two big dogs. Oh, 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 okay. I mean, if they're stuck, then I'm just going to leave them.
Hey, you wonder though if I'll get a uh, achievement for killing them? Like maybe I'll get an achievement for like, you know, kindness to animals, putting them out of their misery, something like that. I just, I just don't have the ammo for it. I really don't. Yeah, another one of these fucking cranks. You know, though, at the same time, I wouldn't be surprised if they get out because I'm going to have to come back down here anyway. If I don't kill them, I have a sneaking suspicion I'm going to have to fight them later anyway. What do you think? Mm hmm. Fuck, uh, I'm gonna go do it. Not to mention, I just, I want to put them down. I don't like the puppies being zombies in here. Bitch. What the oh, there was a third one up here. I'm going to see, I'm going to wait and see if they wake up. Oh, never like dealing with dead dogs, but I'd rather them be dead and quiet than dead and trying to kill me. Okay. I think my work here is done. Autopsy record number 53477. Seven. Name of deceased, Justin Hansen, male, Caucasian, 39 years old. Ooh, are we going to have like patient zero here? Observations. Found dead in jail cell, bed by staff. Hands are still clenched tight due to rigor mortis, which should be coming to an end. He, it's highly likely that he died just after lights out. Deceased was a known kleptomaniac. Incarcerated multiple times. Incredibly, he would steal even while in jail, though that was consistent with his clinical diagnosis. <clears throat> okay, I'm not exactly certain. <gasps> Red herb. I'm so excited. I can't wait to see what happens here. Combine with the red herb. Red and blue. This blend of two different herbs removes toxins, plus it reduces damage taken and guards against poison for a certain period. That's... That's it. That's it. I thought... I thought, but I thought oh. max HP. Uh, well, you know, at least it looks pretty. <laughs> These zombie roaches are just regular roaches. Hold on, let's take a little look at them. Why do they got like, am I crazy? Do they look like they have mustaches? Like, it looks like they've got big red eyes with little black mustaches. Oh, put it back in. We don't need to... Okay, I won't... Yeah, we won't let me pull it out anymore. But I did like the way it was a jump scare for Rika. What are your guys' thoughts on calling them jump scares or pop scares? What? Some people call them pop scares. I always call them jump scares, but... It's like a regional thing. It might be a regional... Nope, push it back in. Nope. Oh yeah, this guy's going back in. Hold on. Uh, we may need to get that guy out, but for now, until we look around the rest of this room, that's totally a guy we're going to be pushing back in. Bloody hands? Uh, I don't think so, boy. It's always fun when you get to be in the morgue, huh? In these zombie games. There's always a morgue in the zombie games. 
<laughs> All right, well, we're definitely not letting this one out. <laughs> Most of these are just like locked for no apparent reason. Like they just won't open. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Although at least those ones weren't moving. Okay, so now we've tried all of them. What's the music doing? Music, stop that. Go away. Is it usual for corners to have, like, a weird fucking psycho board put up on their concrete walls? Also, um, for... Oh, what the... When did that get there? Yeah, wait, this guy wasn't... To this guy totally wasn't there the whole time, was he? No. I'm just gonna give him a blast. Yeah, that guy was totally a zombie. Look at that shit. He was not there before. What the fuck? Okay, so this was the herb. Alright, there's stuff to do in here, because it says, still says currently searching. Daniel! God damn it. Okay, let's see. Back to pistol. Where's the guy? Okay, that's the bugs. Where is the man that was not moving? I'll go check that guy. Okay, this guy's got a flashbang right here. Sorry guys, Daniel's just, he's on a fucking tear tonight. I, I'm about to go like lock him up in a bedroom or something because he just will not stop barking right now. And I cannot have this just going on. Driving me insane. I've separated the dogs. Hopefully, that'll give us at least... Uh, hopefully, that's going to be enough for now. Oh, wait. This was the person that was moving. They're not moving now. Well, there's still one other person that wasn't moving. I'm going to go check out. Where were they? Here, it was this one. Okay. Oh, fuck me. Okay. There it is, boys. The diamond key. Finally. And now he's going to attack us. I knew it. Let's get the fuck out of here because I got no ammo. <sighs> Candle have. Diamond key though, we do have. Dogs, but they were already dead, so technically I just silenced them. Uh, also, before we go check out that diamond door... Oh, what what the fuck? Why are there suddenly zombies now? 
I don't have ammo. I don't have weapons. Might as well go check out this door here that, uh, who I'm pretty sure is Ada went through. Police station B1 map. So basement. Here we go. In the jail. Okay, so the jail doesn't go anywhere, which means this is definitely where we want to come check out right now. Oh, and then here we can see the generator room, which is an area we cannot go into yet. All right, so this means we're going to end up getting the uh, crank down here for sure. Because we need the crank then to get out of here. They won't even let me steal any pens. <sighs> this guy, right? Right? This guy? He better be dead. I just fucking pumped, like, what was it? Eight shots into him? Oh great, a zombie jail. Filled with zombies. Maybe I should go save? There's no save point down here. Yeah, maybe not. This is all... Oh. That's just gonna probably open everything. Last one's alive? No, no, there's a few of us. Oh, that's good news, I guess. Yeah. That's of course Irons sent you. Irons? You mean Chief Irons? Is he still around? Who cares? <laughs> Hopefully he's somebody's dinner by now. What do you mean by that? He's the bastard that locked me in here. I'm sure he had a good reason. He did. I was about to blow the whistle on his dirty ass. I'd have done the same thing to him, I guess. I'll make you a deal. Unlock this cell and I'll give you this. There's no other way out of that parking garage. Believe me. Sorry. I can't do that. I have to talk to the chief first. What? Look, we're both prisoners in this station. So either we play nice and help each other out. Or... Shit. It's coming. What? What's coming? Come on. Come on. Don't be an asshole. Okay, you need this. Just get me the fuck out of here. Oh, okay. <laughs> There he is, boys. Oh, there he is. Oh, my God. Oh, there he is. Who is that? It's just me. So we can put that thing away. I don't even know what happened. It just happened so quick. I told you to get out of here. You wouldn't want to end up like Ben, would you? You knew him? He was an informant. Had information of use to my investigation. Mm. So what he said was true? Hey, you can't keep walking away from me. I don't even know your name. Here it comes. I'm Leon Kennedy. Find a way out. Oh, maybe not. <laughs> Before it's too late. Then we'll talk. Name's Ada. There we go, okay. Yeah, that was right. Well, I guess the deal's on. The deal where we let him out and then he gives us his... Oh, fun. What the fuck am I looking at? Hey, there's the crank. 
Memo, J.O. Power Panel. The power panel is out. Can the person in charge of it please take care of it ASAP? I assume everyone knows, but since the jail's power panel is old as hell, we're gonna need those custom power panel parts. No one makes anymore. There should be a few in the generator room. Addendum. I got word that there's only one of those power panel parts in the generator room. That guy, the guys that's here to fix the bell in the clock tower should have another. So someone swipe. I mean, ask him nicely for it, please. Ugh, what in the world? Oh man, that eye. I'm, like I said, I'm pretty sure this opens up all the doors. And I'm also pretty sure we don't want to do that <laughs> with all these enemies. And I'm pretty sure, yep, yeah, no, no ammo to speak of. Oh, God. Please don't attack me. I don't have ammo for you, and I already shot you a shit ton. Okay, so as far as I can tell, Mr. X then is somewhere around here and not doing anything. He's not in any area that we've been in. That that does make me feel a bit better, but of course we're going to be seeing him. Also, I just remembered that we're going to have to go out into a zombie-laden all the way out here. Oh, thank you, Cody Cat, for that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Good thinking on your part, for certain, for sure, for suit. Well, there's the zombies. Right now, I'm just kind of in a run for it mood, so. Okay, more red herb. Roll of film. Or another. Come on. And then this guy's gonna get me. Okay, cool. I can actually move. Good, good, good. Well, I got the roll of film. That area is done. Got the hand crank. Let's go use that. I've still got such a bad feeling. Definitely not something I want to do when I'm being chased by a ton of zombies or something. Although it's probably just a cutscene and I'm safe during it. I'm not positive on that. Alright. What asshole's gonna attack me now from where in this place, huh? The red... Uh... <laughs> the red, um, herbs anymore. Let's go ahead and mix these together. Fully restores health. Nice. Okay, what I, am I able to mix all three together? Or can you only mix two? What do you mean you remember it? That's good. Aegis. Boxed electronic part. Nice. I hear something moving around. I don't know what, I don't know where, but I don't like it. And it needs to stop. Okay, um, this should be fun. Oh. 
Easy peasy, boys. Okay, well, that's a dog. What? That's a dog oh. that's jumped the fence. God damn it. Oh, oh fuck. What the hell? Oh god, it's got speed. Oh. Um, you know, I'm confused right now. Like, where does this go? Because we're supposed to go back and get the badge so we can go outside. But now I'm curious, like, what the fuck's we over there? We don't have the ammo. <laughs> Oh, wait, didn't it say that we need... No. Are you going yeah, back down you know, that ladder? You know what? We got to go out this way because we don't have... Okay, because we're just trying to leave, period. Mm -hmm. um, so that's why we need the card. But remember, we have one electronic part. We need the other one from the clock tower. So that's why we got to go out that other way. Now, what were you saying now? We need... We have Are we one. able to go back down that ladder on the map? Oh, maybe. Go do a quick save. Yeah. We've done a lot of shit here. Uh. Ah. Oh, Reka, stop yelling. Ow, get off me, motherfucker. <laughs> ah. Ah, serpentine! Are you kidding me? What is wrong with this game? Oh my god, there are so many. Oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck. <laughs> Dogs can't use ladders. Fuckers. That's right, come back when you got some thumbs, you pieces of shit. Baby, your mic is loud as shit right Sorry. Now. There you go. See, it was picking me up like crazy. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that was fun. See, now you can find the green and red. Yeah, now you got all these got all these red herbs. Okay, but for now, let's just save. I think we are done for the night. <laughs> Rick is really afraid of dogs, apparently. <laughs> but yeah, Cody Cat, did you see? It's like it's like dog here, dog there, dog there. And then I get, I'm like, okay, if I get out through this door, the parking garage should be safe. I bust out in the parking garage. I see a dog. I'm like, well, fuck. I'll go around the cars this way. I turn to the right. I swear to God, there was like three dogs over there. What the fuck? <sighs> I ain't got the ammo to deal with any of this shit. I'm doing a double save. I'm doing, you know, I'm doing a double save, saving on another spot. And with that, we are going to switch on over to the ending. Cody Cat, hope you had fun. It's the Gen and Gleviathan. If you guys are still around here, I hope you guys also had fun. <laughs> this is a really weird outro music, but you know what? We're going to fucking deal with it. I'm excited because Halloween is the day after tomorrow. I have a little party with my friends. Cody Cat's going to be there, of course. So actually, is Gleviathan, it's the Jen and my wife. Also, Sinuel and those noisy dogs. Not the ones in the game. The noisy dogs in real life. Hmm? I'm just saying that the noisy dogs outside of the game are going to be at the Halloween party. The ones in the game hopefully will not be there. <sighs> all right. That's enough of all of this. I'm just going to have to say, I already mentioned you guys, so... Everybody else, no matter who you are, where you are, whenever you're watching this, thanks for watching, guys. Stay safe out there, everybody. Have a safe Halloween. Uh, it's one of the most dangerous nights of the year when it comes to cars and pedestrians being hit. So everybody, please, not only be safe if you're out there trick-or-treating, but very much drive safe. There's a sharp increase of kids getting hit by cars on, this, on that night. Love you guys. Don't hit anybody with your car. Bye. This fucking music, am I right? What the hell?